Horses with a history, brands with a background. The Four Sixes Ranch presents the fourth fastest on day two, Regal Eagle. Regal Eagle is the only Rainbow Futurity finalist to also make the All-American. Trainer Eduardo Gonzalez finished second last year, and he hopes to do even better with this talented son of one famous eagle, sire of last year's winner. After a troubled fifth in the rainbow, Regal Eagle was on the mark in his trial. They're running beautiful break. Regal Eagle came away fast along with Ray's Regard. Between them is Spirit Leader. Then back toward the middle of the track is this Eagle's Gone, followed up by Dozer. It's Regal Eagle in front. Regal Eagle chased by Spirit Leader. And here comes this Eagle's Gone and Dozer. Regal Eagle's going to win. Regal Eagle scores by a length and qualifies into the day's strongest headwind. His 51-year-old jockey Larry Gomez was elated with the Colts effort. The best way I can describe it, I mean, when we broke, he was in top, and uh, all I could see is nobody in front of me and just uh, waiting for somebody to show up, but they never did. And, uh, you know, when it's quiet and you're out there by yourself, you don't see anybody, that's a good feeling. Regal Eagle was bred by Lucas Racing and was a $17,000 Rudosa yearling purchase by Nahum and Rosella Prieto, owners of 2003 race winner Bye Bye JJ but it was Larry Gomez who best summed up the All-American feeling. That's my dream come true right there. You know, I dream of riding the Kentucky Derby when I was a buck boy, and when I got into Coda Horses, the All-American. And it's here. Thank you, Lord. Wow. Whew.